guide dogs. New research commissioned by the charity Guide Dogs found that many people are missing, oh, missing out on these benefits because of financial constraints. That's why the charity has started its Puppy Raiser Volunteer Programme. Look what we've got for you, a puppy. Uh, it's a matchmaker to encourage people to take in a puppy for 12 to 16 months. Hayley is here and uh, brought in Oak. Oaky, yes, oh, little Oaky. OK, so tell me about taking in a puppy. So we at Guide Dogs have many volunteering roles, but one of our key volunteering roles is our puppy raisers. So lovely Josephine has brought Oki today for us to enjoy, and he's 17 weeks. Okay. So uh, puppy raiser takes on a dog for us at Guide Dogs from the age of about eight weeks until they're about 15 Hello. months old. Hello. Hello. <laughs> they look gorgeous. And it's, can I have his... Of course you Thank can, you. yeah. And the role is all about <laughs> socialising the puppies, getting the puppies used to things like public transport and different noises, so that when they go on to form one of our amazing Guide Dog partnerships, it's, it, they're used to all of those things in the environment and they've spent all that time there. But why would you um, host a puppy and then have to give him up? The rewarding part of it is, A, we'll give you another one. So <laughs> please don't worry. So, we, yeah, we, we do need more puppy raisers. So we're always happy to, once you've raised one puppy, we'll, we'll provide you with another puppy to yeah. start all over again. I'll take but, my shoes off and get down with it. <laughs> of course you can. <laughs> <laughs> Feel free, bless Thank him. You. But, um, you no, yes. no, 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 don't shoot those. I'll Thank have you. those. <laughs> <laughs> I can see what you're doing. Um, but also... The reward is that you're really helping someone to live an independent life. So these dogs go on to perform an amazing role to be able to support people as a, a working guide dog to be able to have that independence. So okay. really rewarding. And is it, do you have to train them yourself or is it just... So you get support. So yeah, a lot of people. So the research that we did found that actually 18% of people <laughs> don't take on a dog because they feel that they wouldn't have the knowledge to be able to do that. Yeah. Whereas we have dedicated puppy development advisors and supervisors that help you with that journey to okay. be able to train those dogs up. Okay, now he's teething, I'm guessing, at the moment. <laughs> yeah, he's got, he's got lots of little teeth going on, but he does. It's, it's good for them to have environment enrichment. So very much the way in which we train our dogs is about positive reinforcement. Yeah. So it's about having things for them to enrich, you know, having that expectation for him to come at 17 weeks and sit still for a period of time yeah. somewhere he's never been. And does that mean so. we have treats as well? He's got his food, so he has his kibble. Can I? Yeah, you may. So there's some of his food there. Oh. So he's a, he's a very good lad. So sit, he would sit, be. sit. Hey, okay. Hey, sit, sit, sit. Look what I've got. He <gasps> likes a yeah. hand signal. Does he? Sit, yeah. sit. Good sit. Oh, good boy. There you are. Yeah. So at 17 no. weeks, he's a German Shepherd mix. So Is he? Yeah, so Josephine, he's her fourth puppy. So she's already raised two for us. And she's currently actually very brave as a puppy. She's got two at home. So she's got year-old Mabel. And she's also got little Oki as well. That's so nice. I can smell all sorts now. <laughs> come here, Oki. Come here. Come Good around this boy. way and then we can see you. There we go. Good boy. <laughs> he's got the shepherd ears. So, yeah, he's got that really lovely long body. And that okay. Coat, so. Okay. And what do people do if they want to get involved? <gasps> go to Guide Dog's website. There okay. are many opportunities. Okay. He says, I'm going to look at the camera now. Yeah. <laughs> he's doing the whole pose. Yeah. Good yes, boy. Please go to Guide Dog's website. All of the puppy raising as well as other uh, volunteering opportunities are there. Um, but if you can help, please, please do. Guide dogs co uh, cover the cost of everything when you puppy raise okay. for us. So no volunteer should ever be out of pocket. So it's the ability to have a dog, do something really rewarding, but also as well, that, that, that long-term time commitment, 25% sort of, of people came back and said that they didn't want a 10-year commitment, they didn't know where their life was going to be in 10 years' time. Yeah. Whereas actually, you know, we, we support people to, to, to have that journey, to create this amazing partnership. Um, for, for just over a year, you'd have a dog for. And so. then you get another one if you want to. So. Absolutely, yes. Okay. Yeah, so we're just go happily. to the website. Go to the website, yes, at guidedogs.org.uk. Okay, and how many, um, what sort of breeds of doggies, all sorts? All sorts. So our main breeds are Golden Retriever Cross Labrador. Yeah. But uh, Oki here is a Golden Retriever Cross German Shepherd. We also do sort of very few, 5% is just German Shepherds. Okay. So we do occasionally have those. Labradoodles, Labradoodles. Um, Labradors as well. Yeah, you're so cute though, aren't you? There's quite a few, but they're usually quite the, the larger yeah. sizes. <laughs> We're out of time, sadly, but it's no lovely worries. to see you. Thank you very much. Oki, okay, he's a good boy. He's a good boy. <laughs> he's a good boy. He's, he's a good boy. Yes, you're a good boy. You're a good boy. <laughs>